right, guys. So uh, I had a, I don't know what happened when I came back from that conversation on the phone with Matt. Like half the people were gone on that live stream, and it ended up cutting off. So we're back on. We're heading to. We're on Highway 58 now, heading to 43. So Highway 58 and 43, they have Trezell and Jacqueline pulled over right now. So everybody is hauling butt over there. But from what I understand, they have them pulled over. That license plate came back as a hit for a Winnebago. And that's what they're in. I am sorry about that, guys. That, uh, I had to, you know, call Matt really fast. I don't have a secondary phone. So I have really no choice but to call him. We are about 20 minutes away from this location. We'll get there in time. They'll most likely still have them all pulled over right there. I just know they have them stopped and multiple people are on their way there now. can smash that thumbs up let everybody know we're live again I will get as close as I can get so we can actually see hopefully we get time to see the arrest being made or at least see him or both of them in the back of a squad car yeah, I tried coming back on the live, and it said it was like 500 and something people in, but uh, it was buffering, it wasn't no good. I got to the top of the mountain in Tehachapi, and it lost signal. Thank you guys for joining back in. Thank you, Miss Miller, or A. Miller. Thank you. Let me see. Uh, yeah, there. So LV is over there, guys. She's there. She was the closest one. So she's over there right now. And I'm on my way over there. So, but LV is actually there. She was the closest one to that location. Everybody else is heading there now. So if you guys want to see what's going on, feel free. I know it's a big thing for all of us to see what's happening. So you guys feel free to do so. I'll still be live by the time you come back. Let me see, what does my GPS say? What does it say? Oh shit, what the hell is that? just hit something in the road and it felt like I was sliding right now. That was weird. Yeah, right. in bell money. <laughs> That's funny. <clears throat> Let me, if you guys go over to LV's and see what's going on, and if you come back, let me know. Let me know what's happening, if you can, please.
This is why I wanted to come down here earlier, but I couldn't. In two miles, take exit 110B for California 58 West, California 99 North towards Sacramento. Okay, I'm going to have to, uh, in two miles, I'm going to have, okay, so they were trying to leave. Marlena, thank you for that. I appreciate you. Uh, it's kind of hard for me to see your name. Is it Sabrina or Sabrina? Thank you for that super chat. I do appreciate you. Okay, let me, uh, I'm gonna have to start scooting over. Shafter in that area. Here, hold on, guys. I need to hear what my GPS is saying. 58 West. I'm going to plug you guys into my speakers. In a quarter mile, take exit 110B. California 58 West, California 99 North, towards Sacramento. Can you guys still hear me? Can you guys still hear me? Take exit 110B. Okay, so here we go. Thank you for that super chat. Appreciate it. And tell AB I said thank you. AB, thank you for sending folks over. So here we got Tawanda. Thank you, Miss Tawanda. Appreciate you. All right, so we are on the right freeway. I have you guys plugged into my uh, auxiliary cord. For some reason, I can't get the Bluetooth to work. Quarter mile, take exit 25 toward California Avenue. I have to take exit 25. Man, I hope this GPS doesn't have me going. Take like exit 25. A long way or something. In a quarter mile, turn right onto California Avenue. onto California Avenue, then use the left two lanes to turn left onto Oak Street. Left two lanes. Use the left two lanes to turn left onto Oak Street. All right, let me try to read through your comments. Uh, yeah, thank you. Anybody who's uh, in here, appreciate you guys being here. Yeah, LV is on live on Facebook. Yep, thank you for putting that, Miss Heather. If you guys are new or if you, you, know, you haven't heard, Trezell has two arrest warrants for murder. Uh, 
we're, I'm on the way to meet everybody else. This is the way that my GPS is telling me to go on to Highway 58 and the 43. Uh, I'm being told they have Trezell and Jacqueline pulled over in that motorhome. In a quarter mile, use the left two lanes to turn left onto Truxton Avenue. Thank you for that super chat. Uh, Nerlin, sorry, I don't mean to slaughter your name. I'm sorry about that. But thank you for doing that. Uh, her channel name is LV United. Use the left two lanes to it's turn on, left onto Truxton Avenue. It's on Facebook. Does any of my moderators have LV's uh, Facebook link? Mike D. Appreciate you, Mike. Followed the Century Show, the CCTV for the neighbor. It was, bro, big time. Appreciate that. Thank you. Homicide is there. Okay. So they found the Winnebago, but they didn't find Trezell and Jacqueline? You're saying that they just dropped that thing off and left it there, huh? If that's the case, if that motorhome is just there by itself and they're not there, guess what they're doing? They're running. They are running. Zippa. Zippa de doo da. Thank you for sending that. Appreciate you. Thank you for that. Yep, any little bit helps, guys. Mixed family vlogs, appreciate you. Thank you for that. All right, so let's see where are we going. Continue on Truxton Avenue for one mile. I don't know my way around here, guys, so I got to go through the GPS. The Spirit Whisper, thank you. Or the Spirit Whispers, thank you for that. Yeah, it's been a long, hard road, guys, over a year. A lot of tears, a lot of frustration. But I'm not sure. You know, if that Winnebago is there and Jacqueline and Trezell is not there, but they were seen today. In a quarter mile, use the right two lanes to take the west side parkway ramp. They were seen today in that Winnebago at a post office. If they're not in that thing, then that means they're on the run. Use the right two lanes to take the west side parkway ramp. And if they're on the run, we're gonna we're gonna continue find for seven bunch. miles. We'll, we'll find we're gonna find your ass, Tristan and Jacqueline. It can't be that far. If everybody works together, we'll find them. If they're not in that Winnebago. Then we need to be, we need to group up and we need to split and go different ways, a couple vehicles together and start looking for them. They can't be that far. Let me see. Melissa, thank you, Melissa. Thank you for that. I wish I could see all you guys' comments like that, but when people super chat, it changes it a different color and I'm able to, you know, see it a lot quicker. Appreciate it. Uh, I just heard Trezell is in custody. Gunny, what's going on, Gunny? Trezell is dead? What the fuck? Who said that? Who said that? that he's dead. 
Now that would be a twist, wouldn't it? If he committed suicide, right? Stockdale Highway for four miles. I don't know what the hell is going on with my signal. You guys just bear with me. I wonder if there's any... Oops. tuning in to the live stream. I did a live stream earlier. There's an arrest warrant out for Trezell for double homicide. While I was on that live stream, Matthew from AB News Crew was trying to get a hold of me. So I had to call him and he told me that they have Trezell and Jacqueline's motorhome pulled over off the 58 and the 43. I really don't know my way around here, so I'm going strictly off of the GPS. But we're not that much further. We're almost there. From what I'm hearing, as of right now, there's charges on Trezell for double murder. I'm pretty sure they're going to be putting charges on Jacqueline as well here within the next couple of days or so.
Thank you guys for all tuning in. Appreciate it. We're almost there. I guess they have the motorhome as a crime scene. In half a mile of the traffic circle, take the first exit onto California 43 Eno Lane. Alright, so we made it to 43. But where the hell are they at? I was told the 43 and the 58. Can somebody... People are just now joining... Okay, there is an arrest warrant for Trezell. You, you would literally have to look at my first live stream if you're just joining in. There's an arrest warrant, double homicide arrest warrant for Trezell. And from what I hear, they just got pulled over. We're, as you guys can see, we're in the middle of damn nowhere. Pretty sure we are almost to where we have to go. Forty three and a fifty eight should be coming up. That's all I was told that it's the 48 and the, 50, the 58 and the 43. So, is it buffering or is it pretty clear right now, guys? Hit one if it's pretty clear, you guys can see. What? Now it's some lane? In those lane, where the hell's that at now? God, I'm gonna have to. All right, thank you guys for hitting that. I was told the 58 and the 43, so here is the 58, and I think we're on the 43, but where the hell is this? Okay, here's the 58 and the 43. We're here, but where the hell are they at? I'm going to have to. Can somebody tell me where they're at? I was told right here, 58 and the 43. Let me pull over real quick. All right. Wait, 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 wait. 43 and Enos Lane. E N O S. Okay, hold on, guys. I'm not going nowhere. I'm just going to put my GPS real quick. This. Hold on, guys. For Court. Okay, I'm back. Okay, I have to turn around up here. Oh, wait a minute. No, we don't. Hold on. It just recalculated itself again. So, no, I, I just put in the location three in Enos Lane. So, it might be up here straight ahead. This is where it's telling me to go. 
I was told the 43 and the 58, so that's exactly where it brought me to. Now it says we are about four minutes away. Jacqueline was arrested. Oh, here it is. We found it. We found it. All right, we got it. All right, we got it, guys. We're here. All right, guys, we are here. The motorhome is right here to my left side. Homicide is here. Give me one second. Let me get you guys off. Oops, sorry about that. We're here, guys. Yeah, man. Yeah. That's them? That's them? They arrested both of them already. Both? Both. Ooh. We're, they're, they're both here, hey, now. where's Matt? Uh, I have no idea. They're supposed to be over here right now. My life ended. All right, so where are they at? In custody. They're in jail. They took them already? Yeah. Oh, they got them up out of here, huh? Okay, guys, so there is the motorhome right there. There's the motorhome. Hold on, guys. Hold on, hold on. Here we have a crime scene unit is here. There's the crime scene unit here. Homicide detectives, motorhome is right there. We got here pretty quick, guys. So if you're just tuning in, Frizzell and Jacqueline, they have been arrested. Both, right? Yes, both have been arrested. Both, all right. God, it's been so long, huh? That's an official crime scene now, huh? The motorhome? Is that the van? Yeah. Oh, is that? Yeah. That's what the van is. Yep. <laughs> I think I'm on the other side now. I wonder where Matt's at. They were supposed to be here already, weren't they? Yeah. It's way out here, huh? Yes. What were they doing coming way out here? Well, behind these here, there's mobile homes that stay back there. Oh, back here? Yeah, way in the back. So it's a mobile home place. They have one there, and they also have one going out more out oh, that way. Shit. So there's only, that's why I told Laura, I said there's only two out that way. They were so, way out here hiding, huh? Yeah, so wow. nobody would find them. It's a trip. All right, so I guess there's a motorhome park out here somewhere behind these uh, trees. And then there's another motorhome park way out there somewhere. Sorry about that, guys. I usually have my flashlight with me, but uh, hopefully you guys can see pretty good. But they are in custody, Frizzell and Jacqueline. Hold on, guys. Let me turn up my... There we go. This was worth the drive, guys. It's been really long, over a year. Over a year, guys. There's the tow truck coming to get this motorhome. 
Man, I wish I could have got here a lot sooner to see their asses get arrested. Were they uh they were already arrested by the time you got here, huh? Yeah. yeah. Is that Hernandez over there? Yes. It, that is him, huh? Yeah. Hernandez! Is that you over there? Is that you? Hernandez? Is that... Are, you're Hernandez, right? How you doing, man? Steve. Hold on. No, it's kind of hard to see me over there. Steve. Oh, hey, how you doing? Thank you for all your work, man. Appreciate you. Both, both in custody, huh? Hernandez? Both? Gotcha. Yep. Both. That little can't talk means both. <laughs> I wonder where Perez is at. There was a lot, a hell of a lot more cops out here. Really? Right now? Yes. Yeah, I know. That's what usually happens when you go live, huh? Yeah. There is, there it is, guys. So, both of them are in custody. How's my signal right now, guys? Is it not that good, or let me turn off my GPS. You guys would be able to see the motorhome a lot better right now with this tow truck pulling up. Yeah. Yep. That's where we're gonna go. We're gonna we're gonna go somewhere else after here, guys. There it is. That is not the same one, though. They switched. Hey, that's not the same motorhome they had. I told you that was the motorhome they had. That's what we said. What? What was that other big giant thing I don't know. that I would told park you right there? It was there. a rundown one where they were able to drive it. Wow. There it is, guys, the Winnebago. Can you guys see it pretty good now? It's all lit up, tow truck. GPS signal lost. I think it's still kind of a little butthurt. Because that video, because huh? that it's the one we did uh -huh. about Hernandez, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> a little buttered about it. Is that on? 
What's his name? Um, Take this to the media or something like that? No. no that's that's news. News. Oh, is it? Oh, it is. I gotta, I gotta grab something to eat after this, but we're gonna head to uh, another location. So I'm pretty sure that's where they're gonna go. I'm pretty sure they're gonna be going somewhere else. I don't think I wanna say it over the live stream, but other people, if you guys remember, I said there's gonna be a lot of people getting arrested. So there, are, there's other people. Huh? Probably. She says, Wanda was charged too. Wanda, you next? Yeah. Wanda was charged well, too. Was Wanda charged was, too? Can was, somebody was, inbox me? I was told there's 13. It's going to be 16. 16 yes. Oh, 16 now? Yes. Okay. But I don't want to call you Right, right. Miss Hippie, thank you. Appreciate that, Miss Hippie. It's been a long run, guys. It's been a long run. So, um, you guys remember I told you, hey, there's going to be a lot more. You guys remember that when I told you? So I really can't talk about too, too much, but there is going to be a lot more arrests coming. Not just them two going to be a lot more at the time i was told a number has to do with the luck it says lucky what lucky well that's the number i was told then well right now we just heard that it's possibly 16 people that could be charged yeah you're right Life with dream. So, let me uh, get this real quick, guys. Hey, you got. You got yeah, we're gonna help you right now. I'll call you? Yeah. I need to call, get a hold of Matt and them too. See they are, they must got lost. If you take the, the navigation, it'll take you up that way and bring you all the way back around this way. But you're going halfway back into Bakersfield again. My, well, when I here. came right now, I came from way over there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's a different highway. Coming out this is like going out to Wasco and... Uh, oh, okay. Shirley, thank you, Miss Shirley. We have people on there. My apologies, guys. I had to get confirmation that they were both arrested before I could actually say it. Let Matt know where we are. We're right on the 43 and uh, what's the name of the street again? Elon or Elon? It's really easy. Just tell Matt to come to uh, the 43 all the way down. The 43 and the 58. We're literally like. A half, yeah, we're like a half a mile up. So, Matt, if you're watching the stream, you're missing out. You gotta come down to 58. No, this is the 43. As soon as you get to the corner of the 43 and the 58, there's gonna be a Chevron gas station there. Just come a half mile north, and it'll bring you right here to where we are. You can't miss us. Let me, um, I mean, I would have thought they would have been here already. They were up here already. I don't see the name. Hey, excuse me. You guys know the name of this street here? It's Pratt's Fire, but it's still, 50, it's still State Route 58. 58 and Enos Lane. Enos? Yeah. Enos, okay. E N O S. 58 and Enos Lane. 58 and Enos Lane. E N O S. Let's go get a let's go get some close-ups. <clears throat> 
58 and Enos Lane. <clears throat> Matt should be out here. I thought he was following Roe. I see Roe. Yo, Roe. Roe. What happened to Matt? They arrested both. Yeah. Both are in custody. Big time. Oh, Big time. Yeah. Big time. Yeah. Uh oh. So if they if they arrested them both, then that means Jacqueline's getting charged. Yeah, too, she's huh? standing there with him trying to fix the situation when he lying. They both yeah. going down. Both, both. right. Both this is down. this is it right here. <laughs> That's what's up. Thank you, thank you. That's what's up. <laughs> Yeah. Yep. There's a. They were probably hiding back there. There's a motorhome park right here. Is it? Right behind them bushes. Is it? Yeah. And then there's uh, another one like right over here somewhere. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, yep. Lord. Thank you, Lord. Justice. 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 Get a long road. Man, that's that's awesome, guys. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. That little guy was acting a little weird. You no, know, don't know why, but he was acting really weird. Look at this thing. Wow, they have a camera right here. Look at that. They have a camera right there. So Trezell installed a camera on the motorhome. You see that? On the front. Right underneath the Winnebago. Look what he got. Yeah. See that? Got a little camera he mounted right there. Yeah. Watching. You see it? Oh, he did. Yeah. Yep. So no matter where he was at, he could probably tap into his phone and just be watching everything. Hey, but you know what that means, right? All the evidence. All the evidence. Yep. Hell yeah. You guys see that, guys? You guys see that there? Trezell had, huh? Has a straight camera mounted right there in the front. And you know, if there's one, there's gonna be two. He's gonna have another. Oh, it's still on, too. Look at that.
So that's even more evidence, guys. That's even more evidence. Hey! You see what he has mounted, right? Come here, look, come here. You see what that is underneath the Winnebago? Like, uh, yeah, it's a chama. Yeah. yeah. So if he got that one, there gotta be other ones on there. That's all evidence. Yeah. And it's on too. You can see a little red light. The green light. Oh, yeah, the little green light, red light. Oh, yeah. Second degree murder. Wait a second, degree. Yep, it's not over guys. We're gonna be going to another location after this one. All you guys' is prayers and hard work and dedication. This is this is what happens with that guys. We're not giving up, not stopping. We said the boys would not be a cold case, and that's exactly what that means. All you guys who are in here, thank you guys for being here. It means a lot. Thank you guys for all your continuous love and support. Thank you guys for your super chats and just for being you. Appreciate it. Trezell and Jacqueline both are in custody. They are in custody custody and they have been charged with second degree murder two counts two counts of second degree murder but it's not over there's more people that will be getting arrested most likely before the night's over you guys remember you know, law enforcement can't really say too, too much, especially when the camera's running. Well, I was wondering the same thing, if they would flip on each other. I'm sure Jacqueline has, from what I understand, she's been getting her ass whooped a whole lot, right? So, once they got those two separated, Jacqueline might just flip. She might just flip and give up some type of information. Hey man, thank you. Thank you for your hard work, man. You got like 3,000 people saying it too. Yep. They're probably like, fuck off. You guys are the reason why we had to come out here and work this hard. <laughs> I'm just kidding. There it goes, guys. So, you guys want to get that as a screensaver. Here you go. There goes Hernandez. Where are you parked at? Hey, I'm going to follow you. Whatever happened to Matt? Here, wait for me. Hold on, guys. You guys, hold on. Let me mount you in here. Both of them have been arrested. Wow. That's incredible, guys. Incredible.
It seemed like that guy had a little attitude problem. But whatever. All right, so I don't know my way around here, so we're gonna have to stay behind them. I have no idea what happened to Matt and Apple, so that's really strange. Yo, who just sent that? Let me see here. Shirley. Thank you, Miss Shirley. I'm going to have to grab a bite to eat for sure, guys. Not yet. We still have a little bit of time. We could push a little bit further <clears throat> before I get some need. Okay, so we know that they put an arrest warrant out for Trezell, but it's obvious they took Jacqueline in as well. I'm just not sure if they charged her for double homicide yet. And we don't want to put anything out there that's not true, so. But I do know that she was taken in. And I do know that Trezell has cameras on that motorhome. So it might be a year worth of footage. Who knows? Or whenever they got it, whenever he installed it. Even if he tried to delete the footage, it doesn't matter. It goes to a cloud. Now, you guys remember when I was driving over here, coming this way, my live stream kept turning on and off. So you guys just bear with me. It might buffer for, I don't know, less than a minute, but it'll pop back on. Hopefully it does the same thing again. at your comments now has anyone tried contacting Matt and Apple to find out where they are or what happened As I know, um, so what I know is Trezell had two warrants on him. Cali Gal, thank you for doing that. Appreciate you. Trezell has two warrants on him for two counts of second degree murder. Nana, thank you. Appreciate you. Thank you for doing that. But, uh, I just found out when I got out here that Jacqueline was arrested as well. That's what I was saying. I'm not sure if she was charged with the same as Trezell. Once they get them to the station and they get them fingerprinted and booked in and everything, then you guys would be able to look online to see exactly 
what Jacqueline is being charged for and what Trezo is being charged for. But we do know that the the warrant was for uh, second degree murder, double. All right, so I'm behind, behind it now. <clears throat> We're still behind the motorhome. The motorhome's up in front of us. A few cars up ahead. But you guys remember, this is where my phone started acting kind of weird. So if it does that, just keep in mind that it'll turn back on. I can't believe it. I can't believe it that they finally have been arrested for something like this. Finally. And we all knew that something wasn't right with them. We knew that from the beginning, just from their, from the video. <clears throat> Do you guys know that we weren't supposed to see that? You guys know that, right? Can you guys imagine if I wouldn't have never found that video? Can you guys imagine? That was never supposed to be out there. It blew their minds away. Even Chief John Walker didn't know how we were able to get that video. What video? They know exactly what video because they took uh, that neighbor's DVR from him. They took it from him. So they knew what video it was. But whoever had that DVR, they didn't delete it. They tried to. Somebody in that uh, police department, whoever took that DVR from Mike, they tried deleting something off of that thing. They tried to. I was kind of hoping that, you know, it would have went further back, dates further back, so we could see, you know, if we seen got a glimpse of the boys at all, you know? You guys know that the neighbors, when we talked to the neighbors, the lady right behind said she never, ever heard kids or seen kids in that yard. Never, you know? You guys remember that one? Pretty much every neighbor around there said that they've never seen the boys in that yard. But this is huge, guys. This is what we have all been praying for. We've all been waiting for this moment. And now, finally, something has happened. And it's not over. Hey, there's more people that's going to be filling them handcuffs. towards the comments guys so I can catch them every once in a while what you guys are saying we're not that far away from where we're going I don't know I'm thinking maybe like a 15 minutes or so but yeah spread the word Trezell and Jacqueline have both been arrested. 100%. Who is that? Becca was charged with the same. Jacqueline was charged with the same charges. Well, hopefully. Thank you. 
Thank you for letting me know, and thank you for that super chat. You sure? You sure she was charged with the same charge? Because I know they had their warrant out for Trizel. It was two warrants for second degree murder. Nothing was showing on, I mean, we haven't heard nothing about, uh, about, um, Jacqueline. I'm a little worried about Matt and them because hopefully they're all right. Has anyone tried getting a hold of Matt? No, I don't want to call because then it's going to knock me off of the, the live stream. I'm sure he's all right. going to be the motorhome right there in front of, well, it's two cars ahead of us. Yeah, what's going on with that case? It's Summer Moon. What's going on with Summer? There's a few other cases I like I said guys this one's not over. So um we still got a little bit more work to do. But that's a big big accomplishment though for sure. I gotta get 
stream holding up so far is it pretty good all right sweet thank you My stomach is hurting, guys. I haven't had nothing to eat. This morning I had slept a little bit, but not much. There goes the eyewitness news, so it looks like they're going to the same place we're going to. No, I'll get something to eat after. Do you have anxiety? two hours got here pretty quick or what was it, like an hour and 45 or hour and 30 or something like that to find out what's going on I tried to get there on time to see the actual arrest <clears throat>
think we're over here by the police department. Oh yeah, that is the police department. I'm already in Bakersfield, Rosa. If you're just tuning in, if you rewind the video towards, uh, I don't know, the middle, you'll see that Trezell and Jackman's motorhome is getting towed because they both have been arrested. Oh man, they're doing some lane changes. Let me see here. Hurry up. Yeah, I'll grab a bite to eat here in a few. There's like a AM, PM not too far from, from where we're going. I'll grab something from there on the way out. Probably grab a, I don't know, a little AM, PM hot dog or something. Yeah, thank you for posting that, Heather. Yep. That's where we are going. on how they got stopped over there. I'm pretty sure they had an APB out on that that license plate and stuff. Just tuning in, Trezell and Jacqueline have both been arrested. If you rewind this live stream, you'll see that their motorhome is being towed away. And we are here. 
There it is. Let me flip a UE real quick. Is that part? Yeah. Look at this person walking half naked in the street. All right. Let's give it a second. Can you guys see? Or does it look all blurry? Hold on, guys. Sometimes that fixes it. Let me see. Hey. You guys think you're going to get a recipe? Mm -hmm. They probably will, huh? They got a ring camera right there. It's crazy because all the cars that were here earlier ain't right here now. They ghosted off. I guess there was, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, there was other cars here earlier, but no one's here now. Give me a second, I'm going to grab my soda real quick. Hey, do you guys think, um, what do you guys think here in the chat? Do you guys think Wanda West knows what happened? Do you guys think that's the reason why? They never wanted to come out and help us. Look for the boys that just had attitudes and calling cops. and That's exactly what it was, huh? The, the water sprayer's not here. I believe she does know. I think that's a, isn't that a cop sitting right there? There's the church. Somebody's at the door. Somebody just opened the door. Yep. Your son got arrested today. Your son got arrested today. You're next. Your son got arrested. Jacqueline got arrested. 
You guys will be getting arrested next. I hear you breathing out that door. Looks like you guys straightened up the house pretty nice. Got some nice green grass growing. Wicked, nasty people. Nasty. Doesn't matter how much you try to paint the outside, the insides are horrible. Remember, we would come by here and ask you guys if you guys wanted to help look for those boys. And all you guys did was call the police. Act all weird. You got it right, but you got it wrong. What's that mean? You got it right, but you got it wrong, but you got it. What's that mean? You want to clarify? Oh, well, now we can say... You got it right, but you got it wrong, but you got it. You're going to get them handcuffs real soon. They're at the, they're at the door. Where's that water boy at? The water sprayer. Where's he at? Yeah, I hear spraying people with water hoses. <laughs> what, what time is it right now anyway? What time is it? Uh, oh, we still, we got to around 10, right? Yep. Oh, okay. But right now we could, right now we could be a little loud? Yep. So we could be a little loud tonight, just till 10 o'clock. You know, your son got arrested tonight for two counts of second degree murder. Look at the news if you don't believe us. Oh, I guess who's here? The news just got here. Here's the news. Twenty three ABC. Y'all ready? Second degree murder. Trezell is in jail. Next stop is hell if you don't repent. Trezell is in jail. Next stop is hell. Why don't you come clean, Wanda West and Philip West? You guys know, you guys know what they did. They didn't get arrested for no reason. Oh, they know. They all know. There's going to be a lot more people getting arrested because of this. You'll see. Your son was arrested today for killing them two boys, huh? Second degree murder. I'm praying to God they didn't do that. I'm praying that they're gonna do like a nobody case or something, you know? A nobody case? No, I think I think they've got enough. They got enough, huh? Yeah, because when we spoke to the detective yesterday, yeah, he they got enough.
So you telling me that they got enough, as in the boys are gone. Man, guys. A situation. We went to our house a few days ago, and uh, we're outside. Man, man, man. Uh, a friend of ours. Is that hello? What is that? Theirs. And uh, their relatives started talking. Hola. Because she stated that. Yeah, everybody's looking at us now. But um. They obviously have enough evidence. Um, the cousin was jumped. She didn't locate what. She didn't say what location where she was jumped at. But somebody was jumped. She couldn't get. Um, she was being harassed. She couldn't live her life. So when we spoke to the detectives yesterday, um, he got all the information. The house address that we were hey guys waiting watching talking we had somebody else go up and talk but she had us on her speaker oh, God, so we were recording and she gave us the okay to do so and i'm gonna clean my lens she was done talking to them we did call the police department uh we gave them all the information man i sure pray to god that what was told to us um i mean i've heard of it happening it were they done like a trial for like a nobody? Hey, you want to let them know too? West came out and helped Giselle take the seat out of the van. And that was the seat that was behind their shed that they got rid of where Crenshaw and... Hold on, guys. All did our search on Pontwood and Real Road that day in broad daylight, and uh, the sure decided to take it upon herself to go walk a little more, which was a great idea that she did that because she found the seat that they went to go dump. They actually found she found everything that they dumped. So, with that being said, remember, I was telling you guys about the story um, about uh, Trezell beating the hell out of like Jacqueline and beating the boys while they were here. So Wanda West and Philip West, they know what happened. Hey, you want to let them know too? Hold on, okay. Hold on guys, that way I don't get nothing wrong. Faith, thank you. Prior to that or after that, but that was a statement that the cousin had gave that was related to Jacqueline. You want to let them on? Um, Can you do, fill them in a little bit? <clears throat> so, so LV is telling the story to her Facebook uh, page, and uh, you guys up to speed right now on what happened here. So we ran into a um, family a family member of Jacqueline in Bakersfield who stayed at the Castle Loma during the time that they were living there um, just so happened to be walking by. She noticed the family members of Jacqueline who she called as soon as possible which was me through Facebook and told me hey I need to get out there. So got out there um, she just walked by she didn't approach her yet she was watering the grass the cousin was and right here or down by Castle Loma. Oh, okay. um, she lives in a house by Castle Loma on mm -hmm. the same block. Mm -hmm. um, I know the cousin was out there. Uh, didn't stop to talk to her until we actually got there. I was able to, um, through Messenger, we were able to FaceTime each other. So I was recording what she was saying when she was speaking to the girl. Mm -hmm. And she said that they're not on talking terms, her or Jacqueline anymore, neither with the mother Maria, none of them. Um, that she has been jumped by who we don't know. She didn't give names, but she they couldn't live their life because of what their all their family was going through behind Jacqueline and Trezell. Now this was told to the detectives. Everything word per word was given to the detectives. I also recorded our conversation with the detectives. 
And um, next thing you know, Jacqueline and Trezell were having a confrontation with each other because one or the other were cheating on each other. Came to Wanda West's house. Now, Wanda had the kids three weeks straight prior to them coming to pick up the boys. She didn't give a much, she didn't give a date, she didn't give a year, she didn't give none of that. She said before they went missing is all she said. Jacqueline and Trezell got into it here at Wanda West's home. From there, it went left. He started taking it out on the kids. The kids started peeing on themselves. He made them get in the van so they could leave. So he was beating them. Yes. And they peed on themselves. Yes. So from where they left the front of Wanda West's home in their van, the babies had peed already on the seats or whatever it was. She said he came back by himself two days later, and Philip was the one who helped him take out the seat. It was left here. She couldn't give no more. She couldn't say no more. She couldn't say less. That was the same seat that was in the back. So we don't know what happened to the kids. So they went and they dumped a lot of their trash. We had did a, um, the same day they were dumping trash, we were coming back from California City. When we got back into Bakersfield, we started to go up Cottonwood, up up the way to see how far they went, how long they took, because we had helping hands here. We had uh, quite a few others here. I think Roro and them pulled up here, AJ and them all them pulled up here and they were like, why y'all taking shit from out of the house? Leave it here. You know, you guys are removing evidence, this, that, and the other. And then um, how long did it take for them to go and come? So we're trying to like pretty much see how far we needed to go and check in every direction with the little bit of time that they were gone and took it, dumped it and came back. So we're trying to, you know, match that up. We didn't find nothing close by because it was thrown past Casa Loma, which was further down about two miles more, which is right there on Pacheco and Cottonwood. Mm -hmm. Following day, um, we all just kind of like did a search. We did whatever it was. (sighs) Two days after that, BPD had got the case. They did their search. The day after that is when we did our search search as a group. We all spread it along the line and we all walked up, boom. We didn't find nothing. We, um, there was quite a few things that we did find, but it wasn't to where it was in regards to the boys or mm. you know, what we could have captured on video prior to that, that we seen out there, what we thought we were looking for was not out there. Mm. Crenshaw took it upon herself to walk up the canal, off on a canal. Mm. That was in between the two fields. Crenshaw came across the seats and the other items that were tossed from here. And that was the day that she gave her address and I had to cut my video and take it off because she had put her address on there. Mm. And I have forgot that I was recording and people were inboxing, hey, take it off, take it off, take it off. Her mm. address, she gave her address. So I did, I deleted that video, um, but her video was still up prior to that address being given. Mm. So it's on her live feed, um, her videos where she found the seat. I was out there with her. Um, Mm -hmm. it just, and the officers went out there and from what the detective said yesterday, Mm -hmm. the cops that went out there never turned over that information. Wow. Really? Yes. And I got that all on video. Who was that? I have no idea. So (sighs) that's where it went yesterday. So he gave me a number, asked if I could give the number to the person that was talking to the family member of Jacqueline, which I did turn it over to her. Um, She said that she was going to call him um, and give the information. That was yesterday. And then today, the warrant went up for Trezell and Jacqueline, and they were picked up. And both of them have been charged. Well, I know Trezell, second degree. Jacqueline has to be charged with the same thing, huh? We'll find out more. You guys just keep your eyes looking at that on the internet because they still yeah there's a lot more that's going to be getting booked into custody over this one guys and so that was actually the same the story i heard too about uh trezell beating jacqueline here in front of wanda west in front of philip west he was beating the kids so hard to where they urinated on themselves so they know 
they know exactly what happened and what took place. These folks ain't all innocent. I remember there was people saying, oh, they're all innocent. You guys are just picking them. Mm-mm. Nope. Steve, huh? Hey, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, what's up? I just found out about this shit, and I was crying. Did you come from Cal City up here? No, I live here now. Live oh, okay. From these bitches. I'm the one. I, um, yeah, you're going door to door with me over there. Yeah, but I come over here, and I drive by, and this bitch-ass nigga tries to spray me with the water hose all the time. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was a, yeah. Off, yeah. The water hose sprayer. Yeah. People are saying that's actually like an assault. Yeah, I told doing that. Ass. He stopped from spraying me. I told him in that video. I said, you know, if you spray me, because I had my son in the car, I went that way. Yeah. And then he didn't have the water hose. And then he came back. He turned up the water hose. And I told him, I said, if you spray me with that water hose, your ass will be in jail. And I'm going to put charges on you because I have the right to say what I want to say. Like, right. It's pretty crazy, huh? They're both arrested. I know I knew it from day one. I. About two months ago, like I was told not to like say anything, this, put anything on the internet. Yeah, so she, I knew this gonna, was coming. She, she's gonna be next. Oh yeah, that. there's more people. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They'll be next. Trust that. We prayed on that shit. Yep. Yep. There's well, there's gonna be more people getting arrested here, guys. This is um LV. Huh? Yeah, that's LV. Yeah. Nice to meet you. I'm one of the ones that was out there. She was out there in Cal City walking around and oh, okay. uh, nice knocking on the doors and stuff, too. Yeah, the night that they went missing. Uh, are you out yeah, there? no, they were just... I live out here now. They I'm were... Oil deal. I don't live far. Yeah. They were just at the front door, guys. Know, like, they had the front door open. Yeah. Then, of course, they have, you know, that little ring camera right there. Mm -hmm. It's so sad. It is. You know, that's never the easy way out. That's the hardest way to take. That's the hardest road to take. It's taking the south out. Uh, nothing on the news yet. The news, they were out there. They were covering the story, too. So they'll have... I mean, if, you, uh, if you're if you just joining... If you um, rewind this video towards, like, I don't know, the beginning, you'll see that they were towing Trezell and Jacqueline's motorhome. Both of them are arrested, for sure. 100% they're arrested. So, and their motorhome has been towed hey you have a, a a light yeah laura has one okay all right man man guys man 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 but um they obviously they have enough to arrest not just them but there's more coming guys All right, guys, I'm going to read through your comments. I'm going to, I don't think anything's going to happen here tonight. I mean, it could happen super early in the morning. You never know. But um, let me read through your comments. I'm reading them now, guys. And then I, I need to get something to eat. Super hungry. Jamal is arrested. No, did they find Trezell? No, Trezell. Yeah, Trezell's arrested. Trezell and Jacqueline are arrested. I don't know. Somebody's saying Jamal is arrested. Who's saying that Jamal's arrested? That's how little rumors get started, guys. You guys got to really, really pay attention to what is being posted. Because rumors get started and start spreading around like wildfire. But no. The only people that I know of for a fact, 100%, is... Trezell and Jacqueline. What's that? They're uh, booking stuff. They're already booked in? Yeah. Oh, here, let me show you guys. They're already booked in. Are they both charged with... Uh, is this... Here, I got this here. Right here. I don't believe I don't know if they can see it. No, I don't think they can see it. Oh, it just changed. Okay, hold on. So I guess their booking information is on... The website already. Uh, 
trying to make it focus. There it is. Does it say what for? Does it say what for? No, they go to court, I think, um, on the 3rd. So no bell. Their court is on the 3rd. I wonder if both of their courts is on the 3rd. Yes. They might be updating like, the actual charge here pretty soon. No bell. Yeah, uh, I know AB News Group is um, right now. Yeah, there's no nothing right now. Do, does it show that... Uh, the warrants... Jamal was no, no. That's what people are saying on this live stream, too. Oh, Jamal got arrested. No, he hasn't. He said that AB News Crew reported it. Let me try and find it. AB News Crew reported what? I have no idea. Yeah, right. He didn't say that. Somebody didn't hear him right. Okay, so they're both arrested. What I know is Trezell had two warrants for his arrest for second degree murder. Uh, Duty Ron covered... <clears throat> covered it as well. Hold on, guys. We're trying to find us something out real quick. Okay, so they need somebody to confirm that uh, Jamal is in custody for first degree murder. Who's saying that? They said they got it off of Matt's AV page. Off of YouTube or? I believe so. Hey, guys, can somebody. Go and check Matt's video. Oh, here's the charges. Here's the charges for Jacqueline. Can see? Can you no, blow it up a little bit? No, this is how he put. Look, he said, "AB News is AB News crew. Jamal Watkins, your brother was arrested for two homicides. Murder, second degree. Yeah. Is that for Trezell? That's um, Jacqueline. Right okay, there. so Jacqueline." It's confirmed. No, Jamal is not arrested. Somebody sat there and said some shit. And all that was was Matt is letting him know, hey, your brother's been arrested for this. But Jacqueline has two counts of second degree murder. And then we have Trezell. Can you blow it up a little bit? I'm sorry. Trezell has two counts. Oh, wait, there's more. Cruelty to a child. Two counts of that. And they got the false report of emergency because they lied. False report of an emergency and two counts of second degree murder, folks. There it is. Trezell and Jacqueline both are being charged with the same thing. Your son, look, look on the internet. He's already booked in. Two counts of second, second degree, degree murder, murder. Two counts of cruelty to a child. And one count That's of a false I drive by this house every fucking day. This police is all call. They do and they're full of shit. Jacqueline was charged for the same thing. You guys have seen that, right? You guys could look it up right now. Do you have uh, Jacqueline's uh, the information? Oh, not everybody has all of it. So if you guys want to look it up, her in Jacqueline's information is uh, her first name, last name, Jacqueline West. Her date of birth? Do you say that anymore? 1989. Jacqueline West from 1989. They go to court on the 3rd and off Truxton. They have a no bell. Uh, booking numbers are S0231573. That was Trezell. The booking number is for Trezell. What is it again? It is S O mm -hmm. two three one three five seven three. Okay. And his birthday is nine twenty four eighty six. Court date March third, twenty twenty two, eight a.m. Trucks in Department I C. So I don't know what that is. <laughs> and Jackson's. Hers, oh, 12 6 is her birthday. Her booking number is S0-23-13-5-7-2. She also goes to court on March 3rd, 2022 at 8 o'clock. 
and Department IC, whatever that is, and Bakersfield. Okay, cool. Thank you. All right, guys, so it's a no bell because they haven't gone to court yet. It's like as if these are new charges, new effect. They have new charges. And they happen charges, like 412. Uh, so. Willful cruelty to a child. Two counts of willful cruelty to a child. Two counts. And it happened in 2012, I think. Because see the dates? Yeah, that one happened in 2012, it looks like. On April but they're 12th. They're being charged for something old as well. Hmm. Wow. Well, I don't know. If you guys look it up, if you guys look at the dates on that. They have no bell, so they'll be. They have no me. bell. So they're going to go to court, see the judge on the 3rd, and then. You know, the judge would say, well, yeah, we'll give them this bell amount or no bell at all. They could be a high risk and they might not allow them to get out. But you guys keep in mind everything that's going on right now, this whole thing that's happening. I've seen some crazy stuff happen with these court buildings where I'm thinking, oh, man, people are never going to get out. And then sure enough, they're out. I'm like, well, how the heck that happened? So if, or they have no bell, huh? No bell right now, but two counts of, of yeah, uh, cruelty on a child, two counts of cruelty on a child, two, both of them, two counts of uh, second degree murder, and then both of them have the same count for like a false police call or something right. like that. Yeah, that's because when they lie about everything that happened that night. Hell yeah, they did. Nope, he ain't keeping that walking stick. <laughs> Nope. All right, guys. So there it is there. 100%. Both of them are in jail, guys. So we just got to keep track of it now. Court is on the 3rd. And uh, I'll most likely drive out here for that court as well. <clears throat> see what we can find out what's going on now, I do appreciate all of you guys for being in here every last person that has hit that super chat I thank you guys for doing that um, just for you guys even being here all together I appreciate it this is the house of Wanda West and this is where a lot of stuff took place at right there in that house the story is Trezell was in that house beating the hell out of Jacqueline and he ended up beating on the boys they came out here they were urinating on themselves from the way the story is going put them in the van and then they tried to get rid of everything that's sad man that's sad Oh, yeah, I see. I see in custody. Yeah, you're right about that. I'm tired. I'm hungry. So um, I'm going to go grab a bite to eat, guys. I don't think anything's going to happen tonight over here. It might happen tomorrow morning. But, yeah, you're, you're correct. Wanda does know. Uh, Maria Brown, thank you. Thank you for sending something on PayPal. Yeah, if you did that, I'll get it right away. I'll use that and put it towards some coffee or something. Gas, whatever. Uh, sewer rat. Thank you for that. Yep. Glad that they're locked up. You know what? They all thought they were going to get away with this, guys. And because of all of you, man, 2,347 people and a lot more other people that were tuned in earlier, um, it's because of all you guys. You guys kept their story alive and kept their name alive and shared videos and made phone calls. And so now here we are today. I mean, even the people that was starting nothing but pure drama, they kept the story going, too, in this weird type of evil way, but they did. So, appreciate 
all of you guys. I'm going to end up getting off the live stream, though, guys. I've been on here for a while, and I am tired. I have a long drive still. Here's this church here in the corner. And I just need to grab something to eat. It'll be some AM, PM food. Let me see here. Let me read your comments real quick. Support with Steph. I thank you for that. Appreciate you. Yep, I remember that too. And I remember they were walking right here, guys. April, thank you, April. I appreciate you. Yep, this is where they were walking with their little walking sticks that day. They refused to uh, come out and help with anything. At all, man. These people, I mean, what would you guys have done if it was the other way around? You are innocent. You had nothing to do with it. And you had people volunteering their time to come and help. Look, are you going to hide behind your door and flip people off and take their picture and give you a little riddle got it right but you got it wrong but you got it right or whatever the hell she said uh you know what i heard it a few times already e lock i don't buy jackie was abused I think when she be she was behind it all that that's possible man i mean it's possible i'm not saying she's innocent i don't believe she is either she knows what happened trezell knows what happened philip west knows what happened and wanda west knows what happened i mean they try to get their act together real quick right they started fixing their house up and they got some nice green grass in there All right, guys, I do love you guys. I do appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for being here. I'm going to head out. But uh, I got to go get something to eat. A.M.P. and hot dog with some coffee. Depending on how it is, I mean, I'm a little tired. I might go live again on the drive back if anybody wants to keep me company on that drive. That would be awesome. would be great. And I'm out of here, guys. As soon as I find anything out, I will let you guys know. But I will be coming back up here on the 3rd. I'm not going to miss none of their courts. Like, we got to go to these courts and uh, and find out what's going on. Well, but keep in mind as well that because of everything that's going on, too, they might not let us in to the courts because of everything that's happening in the world today. Yo. Yeah, why? Why, you gonna order some food? Uh, huh? Yeah, you can door dash right to the house. <laughs> Who's open right now with some door dash? Everybody. Super tacos. Super tacos? Where's that? I'm about to get some AM PM hot dogs. Spicy. I probably won't be here. I'm about to head out. Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. 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 Okay. Oh, that one right there? All right. Okay, drive safe, you guys. For sure. Thank you, too. All right, guys. I'm getting off. Appreciate you guys. I will see you guys soon. All right, so I might go live again on the way down. I don't know. We'll find out. All right. Much love. See you guys later. Hey.